All right, folks. The deck is Renathal Handbuff Rainbow Death Knight. The goal of the deck is to make our minions nice and juicy so that we can bash our opponent in the face with them, healing up a bunch in the process until the opponent dies. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Watch this! Versus Valera. Another Renathal Mirror. And we have the uh, Hematurge to get us value this game. It's a world where we coin the hero power, but not in this match right now. Where they've got oh, such a fat deck. Okay. We actually drew some of our card draw now. This is a matchup where we might actually have time to get ahead. The Citadel stands strong. Oh, hey, Ma. Oh, welcome, Pedro. Okay, there's no world where they took a potion that, like, has the destroy effect in there, right? They have nothing to destroy here. Let's not risk it, though. Would've been safe. It's a lot of card draw. there. If I'd hit this instead of the Yagoogleizer, that would have been 4 for 4. is how we deal with this. We go this to shoot it into this. We do this first because we're never going to gain enough corpses for it to matter. The loss will be mourned and used. You oh, it's pretty unlucky. That's extraordinarily unlucky. We hit the Renathal three times. I think that, uh... I think that's just the game. Come, try your luck. Need to get something good off of the Hematurge, I think. The second one. Because pretty much, we, we can't make a board anymore for the rest of the game. <laughs> Until we deal, like, that Sonya. You could use a trim. Unless the opponent makes a huge mistake, uh, they just win. Let 
unless I get obscenely lucky somewhere. Unfortunately, that means probably we just wait around and pray for the next 10 to 15 minutes because the opponent's taking a long time and then lose anyway. I can't commit too much to the board or like I just get gigafent. I don't even have an answer or a way to deal with the uh, the one one gigafin. That's how I win. There is still the issue of the board here. You could use a stream. Clear cut. You could use a stream. All right. Just don't get unlucky with the waggle pick now. There's no way to guarantee it, but they certainly can make it more likely. Or not. I did say that them making a mistake was the key to winning from here. I feel like it was kind of just a solved game. With the opponent one. Uh, I don't know. Guess they're mostly just worried about managing hand right now, is the issue. something. This looks like an awfully familiar hand to what I just mulliganed away. Ah. ah. Well, we're going to need that extra health, it seems. Incredible. It's glad to see that the wild experience has not changed a bit. If you see a priest, I would assume it's switcheroo. Didn't how much doesn't switcheroo cost like twenty mana now? Isn't everybody playing like uh 
dragon aggro and dragon inner fire. So what you cost five mana in my time with the deck, I had only about a 35% win rate. Okay, so it stayed at about on par with where it was when it got nerfed. YouTube comments are going to hate that one. You could use a swim. To be fair, it did lose about 10% win rate, but it was still a pretty low win rate deck when it uh, existed. Okay, we missed the healing on that, but we kind of gain healing off of this. So it's about the same, really. Well, we do need corpses, if nothing else. What is it? Did they change any of the text on Switcheroo? Or just increase the mana cost? Switcheroo Priest is really more of an educational deck. It forces you to learn about draw consistency, and you also learn a lot of new slurs if you accept the friend requests <laughs> after games you win. Uh, just like the old god lobbies. That for some reason people re like look back on fondly. Do you think Ma and Pa have kids? Well, they wouldn't be Ma and Pa if they didn't have kids, right? They'd just be a husband and wife. It's time to even the scales. Oh, again, a corpse, chat. It's time to even the scale. I'm getting giga scammed. How do they keep having the card that I explicitly did not want them to have? In the painting that inspired Ma and Pa, the woman is the daughter of the man on the right. You have that backwards. Ma and Pa inspired the painting. They're very clearly older. Like, look at them. Well met. Ruffle, you have to play the Madness Joker. I mean, Yogg, I mean. Wait, which card game is this again? I don't know. They're all starting to run together, aren't they? Give Undead in your hand to... So I'll take this to five. Or I could just go, like, three. Let's see what we hit here. Let's see what we hit here. Now we just got an ogre eventually. Is Death Knight a fun class? Uh, I think so. The fun is subjective. A 
Then all yours. I think I just want to get this down. In worst case scenario, it heals for seven. Then we play this next turn. It's a perfectly cromulent target for my headless horseman. I wonder if we're going to get any head this game. Nope. <laughs> Uh, this is probably just good enough. Maybe I don't need the double body bagger. Ah, I see you brought guests. Not quest mage. Horse man. All right, I'm gonna coin that out. And uh, that'll give us. Time to find some HUD again. Unless we get Mon Pa here, then we'll coin them out. Welcome, PBJ. Oh, good. It's objection time. Maybe not. Wait. Let's coin this. Oh no. Uh. It looks like an ice block, doesn't it? Bask in my radiance. Maybe not. Maybe we're fine. Everything's fine, chat. Stop freaking out! Everyone's freaking out too much again. That's puppet. Another one. Some sort of combo to ruin our day? Um, I don't think Prismatic Elemental would be in a combo deck. I thought it might actually be Ignite Mage for a moment. Uh, it just looks like maybe a Reno Mage. I suppose it's possible there's a Sif somewhere. But we do have Lotheb in the deck. I welcome you in. Horseman. Yeah, we've got a lot of buffs going already. Guess I should probably cash in on them. But I do need one more corpse to make uh, copies of this so that I can get value on this. You can't stop this snow star. Nobody's asking you to. Relax. Rock on sock on murlocs. Oh, the Blizzard merch team should just hire me. I'd play that. Plus, she makes me smile. Yeah, this is maybe the best interactive thing a Hearthstone board has ever had. And I'm getting good use out of it today because all of my opponents are so slow.
I was considering a hero power on my own minion, not necessarily for a corpse, but for the uh, the quilter. But like it adds, it does three damage to add two damage, right? So not really a worthwhile trade. Who knows what secrets will uncover? Just looked up Hearthstone bot, and your video from the other day was uh, the top recommended video. Working as intended. So it's just Reno Mage, it seems. Six, eight, this is easy. Maybe Turtle Mage? Uh, that's not a thing that's possible anymore, is it? Uh, I have Sylvanas because I'm hacking. Same way the opponent has Reno Jackson. By my calculations, you need to chill out. Fizzle has Reno in it then, right? I ain't talking. Double pump as Arano, extra star whip, high mountain ice room for mana spice coming right up. I ain't talking. And this is very basic math, you you still die. What was that? Confounding! Astounding! Oh. Hey, welcome, JJ. Glad you're liking the Bellatro content. We might, uh, we've actually got some Bellatro planned, um, uh, in a little bit today. Appreciate you stopping by, though. What are we against? A priest? So this is going to be switcheroo priest, right? That's what chat told me. Let's go one, one of these on two, and then the other one on three. I think it's very likely to just be like aggro shadow priest. Modded challenges? No, I think I'm going to take... The mod video goes up today. I'm going to see how it does, and then I've got another plan for today. Okay. Uh, maybe it is switcheroo. So we'll just go to 45 health and win. Let the pain speak to me. You could use I a Clear cut. Gargon. It does seem as though it's like the Zarimi, or potentially, it's a Zarimi deck for sure. It could be Zarimi Reno, could also be Inner Fire still. No! Oh! Okay, I'm thinking it's probably Reno. Which does potentially give us an opportunity to get some head this game. Don't worry, though. We have the Hematurge in part so that we can get more Ma and Pa value. They don't retain the keywords. That's disappointing. I mean, that's how the text on the cards works, though, right? Because it, the battle cry gives them the, the text. They don't have it inherently. My blood for the King. Oh, no. They're going to get a Ma and Pa now. Well, now I'm going to get a Ma and Pa. Wait, we could also get a second copy of the Horseman. And fight 
chomp. Look at all these corpses we haven't spent. That seems less likely that they're going to get value off of that than me, right? What's in the box? Cards are not even in my collection anymore. Oh, I didn't realize I had the CNE already. <laughs> Should probably start spending some corpses. Oh, they just won't stop dancing. Oh, this is what I call value. Pretty good hits. Wait, it was raining? I don't know. I was kind of feeling like spring had sprung. Stop. Jeez. That boy's beefy. Pretty good. Oh, I need to unturn though. It's not Don't Reno at least. I just want to start spending corpses so that this uh, can get me there.